We recently received an email from Antonio in Panama City, Florida. He wrote, how can I use my computer to make free long-distance phone calls? That's a good question. We figured we'd let the master of the phone weigh in. Roger, do you dial down the center? No, oh. I don't. I don't believe in uh, bilking other people for my, my verbosity. Yeah, but you, you use the Internet to make your long-distance phone well, calls. Well, you know, the thing is, a while ago, you used to be able, because there's a, a couple of companies that offer free long-distance IP telephony service. Fortunately, those services no longer exist. Fortunately or unfortunately? Well, uh, it was at the time, it was kind of a, we want you to start using the Internet, we want you to use these really cool services, including free long-distance phone calls, which... You know, after time, they found out, well, you don't make any money off that. <laughs> <laughs> and employees like to get paid every once in a while. However, there are still services that use IP telephony that let you make long-distance uh, phone calls through your PC. What happens is, uh, for example, on Netophone that I have here on the desktop, you're, you have a client, you install it, and you just dial a number as soon as you have an account, and it connects with their server online, and it turns it uh, into a normal switched phone call, so it connects to a normal phone from that end. So wow. I can use a headset like this, put it on my head and start talking to someone and then actually have it talk, have myself talk through the machine and actually contact someone on the other end who's on a normal telephone line. Okay, so this program is, is free? This service. This service. It's just, it, once again, there's no longer a free service okay. that, that, lets you, uh, that lets you do that. Uh, I, you know, the, 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 the... You heard the bell? No, I heard something, but I'm not sure what it was about. Uh, what it does let you do is basically if you, for long distance rates, like for example, uh, across the country, it's not that, com it's not that competitive. It reminded me of that Warner Brothers cartoon. Uh, Which one? Uh, when they hit the bell and it subliminally gets the guy to ready to box. In any case, you know, it's, it's dial. Pretty, it, yeah, you can dial. It's pretty cool. Uh, overall, though, if you're gonna if you can do international calls, it's actually it's actually cheaper. But if you're doing like local long distance, it's about the same as your uh, local telco that you have. Okay. Uh, now, if you're using something like Yahoo Messenger or NetMeeting, like we often talk about, you can actually use voice to do that. Yahoo Messenger is actually kind of cool. So let me pull this uh, let me pull this up here. And I'm talking to my CFH buddy from the old headset, CFH buddy, and I can actually talk to him too. Uh, I have voice enabled within my chat if you notice in the instant message right here. And actually, let me just see if I can get Dan to Dan talk to us about stuff. And if... Uh, Wait a minute. Aren't you connected by voice yet? Uh, he is. And we should actually be getting... Now we get this. Are we getting... He's talking. And are we getting... Oh, I'm seeing... Yeah, oh, you're seeing... Can you hear me? Here yeah. we go. Yes, I can, I, I can hear you. Um, hey, it's Dan. What, uh, Dan, tell us your favorite thing you like to do. I love you, Roger. I'm your biggest fan. See? I told you I had fans. You liar. Anyways. Uh, it's a <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> he forgot to lock down AOL's instant messenger. Which is, uh, which is one thing I'm going to probably mention that you do want to do. Everybody, Listen. instant message Roger right now. And tell you you love me. Come on. Tell them instant you message love me. dip switches with 3Z. Come on. You can do it. See how many viewers we have. So, three. We have three viewers. That's it? Yeah. And one of, oh, oh, come four. on. Here we go. Say, I love Roger instead of the hi. Someone's Say, I love Roger. <laughs> eh, whatever. But in no, any case, uh, it's actually a really cool free way if you have Yahoo Messenger to contact someone and you just want to do a voice chat. However, they need to have uh, Yahoo Messenger installed on another PC. You can't do it through a Mac, so if someone has a Mac client, you won't be able to do the voice, uh, voice to voice conversation. Fair enough. Oh, this is Yahoo, not AOL Instant Messenger. My bad. I thought, was, I thought it was AOL. That's fine. We can still cr crash it. Thanks, Raj. If you want to learn more about saving money and using your PC for long-distance conversation, waltz on over to our website, techtv.com slash call for help.